charismatic, charming, and funny. That is how family members are remembering an 18-year-old man who died in a car accident on Tuesday right near Sherman and Villard. The family today spoke with our Sam Kramer, who joins us live tonight. Sam, we've learned new details on what exactly happened here. Yeah, hi there, Steph. Demarius McRae just bought his first car on Sunday, was headed home from the DMV after getting it registered when he crashed into an SUV. But tonight, police say McRae ran a red light just moments before that crash, while his family is still struggling to believe a man so full of life is now no longer living. Father, would you bring us to? You're able to see us through. Huddled together on the corner of Sherman and Villa. Yes, Lord. The Milwaukee family struggles with its new reality. He was the type of person that makes you smile when you're around him. He was like, hey, Zan, how you doing, sir? Nice to meet you, sir. He's just such a bubbly and fun young man. LaCandra McRae says her younger brother, 18-year-old Demarius McRae, was headed home from the DMV when his silver car collided with a black SUV at this very intersection Tuesday morning. Paramedics took McRae to the emergency room where he died just minutes after he arrived. It was like somebody took my heart and ripped it out my chest. That's what it feels like. They took my heart. My brother was my heart. A Milwaukee County Medical Examiner's Office report says McRae had a green light while traveling south on Sherman when the driver of the SUV ran a red light headed east on Villard. It says both vehicles were likely speeding. But late Wednesday, Milwaukee police confirmed in an email to Fox 6 that it was McRae who ran the red light striking the SUV. I wanted to think, was, was he crying? Was he sad? Did he feel alone when it happened. Police say the four people inside the SUV ran from the scene, but one came back later and was arrested as the McCrae's hope for closure and for the city to address reckless driving. We just have to pick up the pieces where they fall. Now, Milwaukee police do still have the driver, the 18-year-old driver of the other vehicle, the SUV, in custody. Charges against him are pending, according to police, but we don't yet know what those charges actually are. We're live tonight outside the Milwaukee County Courthouse. Sam Kramer, Fox 6 News. You certainly feel for that family. Sam, thank you.